What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today is gonna be a fun one because these wheels are finally gonna be mounted on the car. These wheels actually need to get mounted first and then we need to drop it off at Randy's house. And then we go home from Randy's house and then we get the prelude and then we go back to Randy's house. Big hassle because the car is so small. What's up guys, so the wheels are actually loaded into my dad's car and I'm heading to Vex right now. I really wanted to use the Ayas, but my dad won't let me because it's not insured. Make sure you guys have insurance before you use your car because it's really dangerous and you can't trust everyone else on the street. Alright guys, so I'm finally at Vex and if you guys need anything from Vex Motorsports, please hit up Jay. The guys over at Vex will help you guys out with alignments. You can buy new wheels, you can buy new tires, uh, you can buy coilovers, you can buy anything. Shift knobs, all the small stuff. So please hit up Jay from Vex Motorsports. I'm gonna put the IG right here. Yo, Fabian's gonna help me out. Let me help, let me help him bring in the rest, because uh, I don't wanna feel useless. <laughs> I literally almost dropped my new wheels. What happened was I was carrying in the wheels and the box was upside down and the bottom was open, but luckily I was holding in to like the inner barrel. These are my new tires. For the 9.5, I'm going 215.35, and for the 10.5, I'm going 225.35. I don't think you guys are ready. All right, I'm sure you guys the wheels right now. And look at the stretch. You guys think I'm fucking around? I'm just kidding. This is uh, they haven't inflated air into it yet. So if you guys are in San Jose or Santa Clara area or even Milpitas, please head over to Vex Motorsports. The guys over here are so nice. They'll take care of you guys. Please hit them up. I'm gonna leave the IG again right here. They're really great people. So I've never ran a 10 half on a prelude before. I don't know. If mine and Christian's calculations are right, these should fit perfectly. But it really helps because they are 22 offset, they're not lower than that, so I don't know. I think they'll fit fine. Damn, bro, I've never put anything this wide on the prelude before. <laughs> pretty sure they fit fine. Fuck it. It's pretty good stretch, actually. Yeah. I was gonna go 215, bro. <laughs> no, I really wasn't gonna go 215 on the 10. 10 and a half, I mean. Yeah, Randy would told me I was stupid, but I was like, <laughs> what do you mean? Dude, you seen two with the, like one inch stretch. Did it work? Did it work? Did it work? No. Nope. Uh, damn it. He brought out the big boy. It's hella funny. It's just hella loud, huh? I'll step over here. Oh my god. It's just hella loud. What the oh fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo, this stretch looks really good. But I have a problem. I think once my dad sees my wheels, he's gonna bitch at me. <laughs> he, he he saw the wheels, but I'm pretty sure once he see how the tires fit, then <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> dude, he's just gonna bitch at me, bro. It's time to get the wheels loaded into the car and head to Randy's house because I can't wait to put these wheels on. So before I go home and grab my car and work on it, hey, hey Thomas, why are you copying me? <laughs> <laughs> we are actually gonna go grooves and get some light bulbs or LEDs. All right, guys. So we are now at grooves, and I picked up these bulbs right here. This one is for the dome light in the front, and these are for the cluster. I read online they said they use three of the 194s, which are these, and then two of the 24s, which are these. They're the same size, I think, but they're just flatter. So hopefully these fit. If not, then I have to come back and exchange them. Yo, the service here is great. They give you free other pops. Yo, I think I want a red one. Hey, Randy, they give you free other pops here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> That's mine to give back. Yeah. Damn, Christmas came early. I know. You got I'm, your camera? Yeah, I'm my own secret Santa. <laughs> <laughs> I almost fell, you saw that? Yeah, man, you break all the shit, no refunds. <laughs> you guys need any electronic stuff from alarms to new 
dashes to any of that stuff, LEDs, all that stuff, be sure to hit up the homies over at Gurus Electronics. Let's go. All right, guys, change of plans. Uh, Randy ended up being really busy, so now I'm at Kevin's house. Now I'm gonna put the car on jack stands and start taking out the wheels. All right, guys, so the car is finally jacked up. Now we need to take out the wheels and put on new ones. I don't recommend these because if you're running stock studs, uh, I don't think your lug nuts will screw on enough and your wheels might fly off. But I'm gonna really impact them down, so I think I'll be good. All right, guys. So if you run these spacers, like the step-on ones, make sure you have full six like turns for you to be safe. Um, I had about five, so I think I'm good. But let's just get this front on. So we get the rear started. This thing looks sick. The other side still has wood blocks, so that's why this side is a little bit higher. But that stretch looks so good. I love stretch. Love stretch. Hey, 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 you. And these people around it. Yeah, people without stretch, bro. <laughs> I was kidding. <laughs> it's, uh, I was kidding, but it's like with true. That guy sees me all the time. Never do, do anything. You see Thomas here? Start revving. I know, dude. You, you intimidate people, bro. It's because my car is lower than yours. <laughs> Stupid. Look at my shit. Laying frame, bro. <laughs> Stupid. Laying yeah, yeah. lip? You don't have to tell him that, man. <laughs> I can't show you guys yet, but if you guys want to find out what Kevin's doing to his 240 right now, yeah. please head over to his channel. Um, I wish I could move the camera lower, but he's actually doing something right now. To be honest, I'm sure like they might know, but who knows? Just head yeah. to the channel. You guys oh, know. well, they could know if I showed them right now. I right, chill. Don't do that. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to give you a sneak peek on what Kevin's doing to his car. Check this out. Right there. That's all you get. Ugh. Woo! Magnetic. Sparks. Yeah, hold up. I'm going to find the woods. I'll be good. Guys, give me a big thumbs up if you guys like polished wheels. These are pendant silver, they can only do so much. The polish looks so fucking amazing. Look at this. Oh my god. I think I just jacked up the car so it's like a little bit high right now, but I think it's gonna start to sag in a bit, but Dude, these wheels look so good on the car. Damn. Looks sick, huh? Good. Dude. It's good, dude. And don't worry about the bumper and the lip. Uh, Caesar's gonna fix that for me in around next week, I think. Mm. But, dude. How, how, how are you with the fitment? The fitment looks really good. I added an 8mm in the front. I think it's an 8mm. Do you want to go more poke or not? A little bit more poke if I wanted I to. A little bit more poke would look sick. Because right now this is plus 14 with the spacer. And I ran plus 10 before. What about the rears? Do you want to poke more too? The rears? I could poke more, but I'm not stiff enough. Oh, so you, you, you don't want to risk it. Yeah, I don't want to risk it. The car has new wheels, but the only thing wrong is the car is super dirty. So later me and camera are actually going to go to the car wash together. Alright guys, just made it to the car wash. And damn. The way the wheels are glistening, I just love it so much. I never really put polished wheels on this car before, so it's new to me. And then this part here, finally driving Civic Gap for three months. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fuck it. Let's just get the car wash started right now. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> extra minutes. <laughs> extra minutes. Fuck it. <laughs> hey, the front. Yeah. You gotta take advantage of everything, guys. Fuck yeah. How many times are you Yeah, you're right. You like that shit, huh? Yeah, 
<laughs> what the fuck? Damn guys, I think I'm in love with this car again. For the fifth time, I'm in love with this car again. It looks so good when it's washed, but when it's dirty, it looks so disgusting. But man, the wheels look so good. I love it so much. Huge shout out to Varsum Wheels for making these wheels look so good. I never knew that they do polishing, so... Now I don't know. Maybe next time I get wheels for the ice 3 I'll go through them. Alright guys, I'm ending the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Give this video a big thumbs up if you guys like the wheels because I love them so much. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Uh, Cobra. the fuck are you making claims about all taking it? What would you do if I eat oh the my head? Uh, you die. No, what you give me? If you ate the head and I gave you something, you died. I get that thing back, so. So eat on Okay. Bro, we don't, we don't. But don't eat the head. There's still venom in that watch. bitch. You didn't get no shots. Oh, you're sad. You want another? John, you're not taking a shot. No. Me either. Yeah, this is wine. You're supposed to. Let's go. One, two, two three. three. I need change. Bro. It's not that bad. Oh, oh. <laughs> An aftertaste. Ooh. How's it, Thomas? I'm really. I didn't well. get a taste. It kind of changed. I guess he tasted it. I'll clog the left one too. <laughs> <laughs> Ew! Thomas, you bitch! I'm good, that's kinda gross. <laughs> it's already clogged, we're gonna have to scoop fucking yak out of no, the I, I, How you feeling, Thomas? Like, on the right Take a shot of snake liquid. I'm gonna make it to where it's disappearing. Caps on the-